So, a little update. My PLL SSTC. I removed the audio modulation section. You can see a jumper there where it goes to ground the way it is without the audio modulation. Also cleaned up the board a little bit. Half bridge is the same, working beautifully. No issues there. I moved the variac, which is now on the floor there. Now, you know I had the breakout on the lead going from the secondary to the top load before. And I tried everything. I tried heat shrinking, I tried taping, I tried gluing. Nothing worked. And I've had this problem since I first built this coil. Then I realized, in a stroke of brilliance, there are really only two ways to get rid of Corona. One, avoid sharp points, also small radius points. And two, when you can't do that, shield it. Now, shielding with a dielectric never seems to work. It always breaks down through the dielectric, and then you get corona and fire and other things that are bad. Shield with a conductor that has no sharp points. So I took this scrap of copper pipe that I have, and you can see I just fed the wire through it. That's basically bare copper line there, 30 gauge, because all the enamel's been blown off. Just fed that through it as a shield. It's not really on there very much, just sitting there resting. The wire comes up through, and goes up as normal. And I will be getting a toroid for this. And lo and behold, it works. It works beautifully. So here's second round. kicks on around 50 volts EC and I can actually dial it back down now and it stays oscillating there just around 24 volts EC still running cool self oscillating no issues I'm happy with it now I'm gonna leave it as it is and let's dial this bad boy up No Corona. Seven inch arcs. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. That's it for now, folks. Later.